Sassoon Docks is one of the oldest docks in Mumbai. It gets its name from David Sassoon, a Baghdadi Jew and the leader of the Jewish community in Bombay. It is located in Kolaba in South Mumbai. It is now home to Mumbai's oldest and largest wholesale fish markets. The docks were built by David Sassoon & Co. in 1875. Every day in the early morning, men wait to be hired to transport fish from incoming trawlers. The fresh cash are transferred from the trawlers to be sent away for auctioning. Tempos full of ice are sent in the fish market and later the ice gets crushed and kept in containers to keep the fish during the auction for the whole day. The auction usually starts after all the fishermen and women start collecting and separating the fishes in different containers of different species. After the separation is done, they wash the fishes and bring them to the auction place where different fishes of different species are sold every day at a price of 500 to 2000 or even more depending on the species. Oh, 
Quiera, quiera, quiera. नहीं मिला तो तीन थाम उन बस थे समावरा नहीं मारा थाम दी थी कोई चर्दी उसके थाम बाजे बाजे पावसा बने का बंद बस्ते पावसा दोन महीना बंद बस्ते Rather than revamping the dock to be more tourist-friendly, the need of the hour is to rebuild basic infrastructure requirements of a modern fishing village. This includes sanitized spaces for cleaning of the daily catch, modern cold storage facilities, efficient transport terminals, none of which have been provided. The more early you come, the more fish you get. The fish get easily sold by the evening. The site in itself offers a livelihood to over 150,000 people, clocking a daily turnover of about 2 crore rupees, of which half is exported. Sassoon is a wet dock, which means the boats can enter the dock at all times because the water level remains the same regardless of the tide. A visit to the docks is almost overwhelming. The stench of fishes extends for miles, the sight of colourful boats and their flags competing with the colourful saris of Koli fisherwomen, buckets full of fishes and other sea creatures, and more. More than 1,500 trawlers bring in around 20 tonnes of catch every day.